Hi guys, this is my Galaxy Nexus and I'm running Android 4.1 Jelly Bean. I got this update like two days ago and I must tell you that I'm really happy with it. I loved ice cream sandwich as well but Jelly Bean is just too good. It's more polished, more fluid and much more faster. So guys, I'm sure you must have seen tons of videos on YouTube uh, telling you about the features of Jelly Bean and how it is much better than Ice Cream Sandwich. But here I am to tell you the main things that I have noticed about Jelly Bean. The main things that I use and uh, me being an Indian and residing in an Indian city. Uh, what things I use mostly from Jelly Bean and what things I find useless. So let me first talk about the voice search, the new voice search in Google. Uh, me being an Indian, my accent is different, so it doesn't understand many things. Like for example, let me just show you an example. And plus, uh, my Wi-Fi is really slow, so it keeps on recognizing and just does not give me the results soon. Uh, let me just ask for something. How old is Aishwarya Rai? Okay. Rai is 38 years old. This came out correct. I'm really surprised this came out correct. But uh, many other things like Indian locations and uh, many other things don't work. Plus, they don't show the uh, picture with the card. They are just showing me the information. Like they showed in the Google I.O. the demo. Uh, the, the cards are totally different. And yeah, it gives me the other normal results. So this is Google Voice Search. Uh, it does set alarms for you. And it does give you information regarding all international searches, international people, international sports people because that's what Google Voice understands much better. Uh, other normal Indian accents, Indian roads, Indian people, uh, it usually mistaken. Same happens with the uh, offline voice dictation. Uh, offline voice dictation is good when you speak only and only English. A use of little Hindi words here and there and that's it, you're gone. There's, that There happens a typo. So that's all about the Google Voice. Okay guys, the next feature, Google Now, totally useless for India. Absolutely useless. Uh, it's just giving me the temperature of the uh, city I'm residing in right now and nothing else. It won't give me my traffic and other stuff because uh, plus it can't read out my calendar because my calendar is just full of birthdays and nothing else. I don't have any appointments as such. So Google Now I think is kind of useless for me right now. It's not of much use. Yeah, although I do like the Google Voice search. So... Oh, no use Google now. So sorry. And the new camera UI. It's totally amazing. It takes fast pictures and the whole uh, film strip thing is just amazing. I just love it. Totally love it. So the new camera UI is definitely useful and love it in Jelly Bean. Thank God uh, Android uh, got this from Windows. I, I know they copied it but still I like it. The new notification, amazing, absolutely love it. Uh, but just, I, I just find the design a little more duller and I don't know, I was used to ice cream sandwich. I like the ice cream sandwich design of the notification bar much better. Uh, and I just, I don't like the design, but uh, the whole thing where they show you the missed call and they give the options to call back or uh, check out the call log and all that thing is really good. So, okay, I'm, I'm a little happy with notification, but didn't like the design as such. And then when you go into the app drawer, you find a new app, which is called as the Play Magazine, which you can see right here. So this Play Magazine is again useless in my country because, uh, you know, it, it will uh, touch the shop icon and it will give me the options. But when you go in, it just don't show you anything because it is not supported in our country. Uh, it's not supported in India. So it will only give me a list of apps and no magazines. So even this sucks. Then the whole thing when you, uh, which is about arranging your widgets, it's, it's good, you know. It's fun. The widget uh, movement, it happens automatically. But it gets annoying when you have to put this thing into a folder and, you know, the folder just goes up and your finger goes and, and then sometimes you if you get lucky you get that option to put it inside the folder but uh, you know look at this I'm still trying to put it inside and it's not going inside. Ah, huh? finally. So that's one problem. 
So guys, that was my little review on Android 4.1 Jelly Bean. Since I've used it for two days, that's what I've experienced. And if I experience something more, I would definitely tell you guys. Um, uh, although Jelly Bean is not at, as much optimized for India yet, uh, and many other things and languages are not supported yet, uh, still I love it. I absolutely love it. I be I love my Galaxy Nexus more than any other handset which is there in India because it's a pure Google experience which no other handset provides except the Nexus devices and that's why I love this phone it's slim it's sleek it's sexy it has a beautiful HD AMO LED screen and I absolutely love it and plus on the plus side I'm very very happy because I'm the first person among my group to get in uh, my hands on uh, Jelly Bean and my group people even though they own S2 and S3 and many other amazing handsets uh, they don't have uh, Jelly Bean they are still stuck on ice cream sandwich and while I'm using Jelly Bean one little note I would like to add uh, is this. I got this from, uh, phone from my fiance. Uh, he got this, uh, he bought this for me uh, from eBay. And this was uh, a handset from Hong Kong basically. So it had a Yakju ZS. Uh, it was a Yakju ZS version, which is uh, not uh, officially updated by Google. So I flashed it with a Yakju. And uh, when I flashed it, I uh, on 13th of July I got the OTA from Google that uh, my phone is going to update uh, into Galic, uh, into Jelly Bean and so I did it and, and I'm really happy. So I suggest people those who have Galaxy Nexus and who don't have Yakju uh, on their devices do uh, flash it on your devices. It will definitely erase all your stuff but it's worth flashing. So I suggest flashing and I love Galaxy Nexus. I just love it.